Hi, I'm Ant, and I'm a pace setter at home. Okay, so today we're going to do some multi skills, and we're doing hockey. And the first thing we're going to do is do some dribbling skills, but we need to be able to hold the hockey stick properly. So, put the ball down. Grip, top of the stick with the left hand, middle of the stick with your right hand, okay? So you should be able to move the stick from side, twist, and back. Forwards, and back, like that. The reason for doing this is you're only allowed to play the ball with the flat side of the stick. Okay, so move the ball side to side, like that. And practice our basic moving the ball. And we can go forwards and backwards, forwards and backwards. Okay, now then, you might not have these, but I've got some cones here that we're going to put into a diamond in front of us. Imagine that diamond. It's a clock face. So you've got 12 o'clock, 3 o'clock, 6 o'clock, 9 o'clock. So what you want to be doing now is moving the ball from 9 o'clock to 3 o'clock, 12 o'clock to 6 o'clock. 9, 3, 12, 6. Keeping your feet well out of the way, your hands moving, keeping the ball on the flat side of the stick. Now I'm using the tennis ball for safety. You might have a hockey ball if you've got a bigger garden. You can use that. Move that around, all right? Now you may not have a hockey stick and a hockey ball, so you might want to get some oh, something else to practice with. I managed to find an old golf club in, in the house, so move it, twist, move, with a hockey ball, practice like that. Keep your feet well away from the cones. Okay, that's one option. Or if you haven't got cones, you might want to find in the garage some old pots of paint. You can use them. Again, a bit wider, move the ball side to side, and forward and go around, keeping the ball and the stick working together all the way, and your feet well out of the way so the ball doesn't hit your feet. Okay, if you haven't got those, or you're working indoors, and your mum doesn't want paint stains on the carpet, perhaps get some, some tins out the cupboard and use them. Again, from 9 to 3 to 12, so they're keeping control of the ball. And you try and do it without making a noise on the stick. So if you're indoors, maybe best to use a tennis ball, side to side, okay. And if you haven't got that, then maybe put them on a few pots, some old vases from the cupboard, use those, and you can move around the ball. Before. Be very careful not to chip your mum's best crystal bars. Okay, so have a practice at that. Put those out of the way. Put your stick in your cones. Okay, tennis ball. Side to side. Give that a go. 10 15 minutes of practice a day to improve your stick skills with your hockey stick. I'm Anne, I'm a pace setter at home. Thank you.